guys, welcome to a not old community kid tutorial with special guest The Riddle. Bit of a, he's a live audience member today. Um, so. No. 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 Um, software tutorial needs to concentrate here, you know? You could do a Photoshop thing on how to change a drum kit to look like it has more snare drums. Yeah. Bit of a manipulation. Anyway, back to it. Yes, yes, thank you. Um, Alright, so today's tutorial runs, pretty much runs on iTunes as opposed to Photoshop or GIMP. Um, I'll give you more details in a sec. Alright, so I'm just going to start the screen recorder. Now, this wallpaper is actually what we're going to be making today. Well, not this exact one, but something like it. This was copied off iTunes. Now, um, if, you've, if you're familiar, familiar with... Um, Windows or Windows Media Player, if you play a song, it'll come up with this really weird graphic thing. iTunes does it even better. It's like a really awesome 3D, um, spacey thing. I'll give you more de um, details right now. Press Control T to. Yeah. It. So, here's iTunes. Um, this is the, the up to date version, 9.1, I think. Uh,. Down iTunes, iTunes nine, nine point zero three one five. I've got. To be accurate. Yes. <laughs> All right. So I want to play a song, and I'll play Gorillas' Plastic Beach, um, Stylo I'll from the Plastic that. Beach album. I'll get you that for your birthday. That's all right, mate. All right. So I'm playing the song, and if I want to go this visualizer thing, visualizer is what it's called, just press Control T, and we come up with this really awesome, uh, it's almost high definition, um, spacey visualize, visualizer, visualizer, uh, effect, yeah, effect, um, yeah, so, um, if you've seen my screenshots tutorial, um, it's, I've got a lot to do with this one. If you've um, just turn the screen recorder off for a sec. This button here, uh, print screen. That is what you'll be pressing as soon as you find the um. Yes, as soon as you find the right um, the right slide, the right um, the right moment. So. Yeah. I am. Oh yeah. Um. Alright, so when you find a good a good moment, um, just press print screen. Uh, oh, chat, chat, chat. <laughs> Do like a Nickelback song or Paramore, right here. Yeah, I just I just hit print screen. Alright, so out of iTunes now. And I just move the toolbox. Alright, so GIMP's open and just go edit paste. Now I'm currently running two monitors, so this is why it has the two the two desktops. So I just zoom out to oh, 25%. And I just get the crop tool, which is here. And just do a rough crop of the black of the desktop. And yeah, so when you get this. I'm just going to zoom up to 50%. Yeah, that's really cool. Um, you might, you guys, hopefully got a better one than me. But um, yeah, when you when you get that, just go file save, and we'll go to where you want to save it. So I'll go to my YouTube files, Tora files, your folder iTunes wallpaper uh, visualizer uh, yeah yeah whatever it is or wallpaper and just go wallpaper <laughs> come on JPG export 100% 
and then I'll just export its thing. I'm closing GIMP now and there's my original file, the space of my Nordic Media Space iTunes wallpaper thing and that's actually quite a good pick. I added a lens flare there um, this, that was in Photoshop so um, yeah I'm just going to go to my YouTube files and it is You've got a hell of a lot of folders. Yeah. So you remember where they are? Yeah. The old Dino Pi? No, I don't. Oh, uh, here we go. Three point one four one five nine two six five three five eight nine seven nine three two three eight four six four eight four eight eight three. Mm. I have to live with this guys, I have to live with it all the time. Three point one four one five yeah. Yeah, got it. Yeah, we got it. <laughs> Alright, so there is our wallpaper. Um, well, my wallpaper. It's not even my wallpaper. I'm using this Nighthawk Media one. Awesome. Alright, um, so that is my screen capture. Hopefully, you guys got a better one than me. But, um, yeah, thank you for watching, guys. Um, bit of a tip for you. Make sure when you're hitting print screen that, um, you get it on the split second that you want it because, you know, the, um, a lot of elements of the wallpaper change quite rapidly, so you might not get it the way you want you wanted to in the first place. And you can't reverse the um the visualizers too, which is quite hard, um, quite sucky. And if you pause the song, it doesn't make a difference at all. It just keeps doing its thing. Um, I do think that the the, um, the iTunes version of the visualizer is quite good. It's um, a nice, a lot yeah, it's window. a nice nice three D um. It's almost like it's been made with After Effects or something with all the um with Windows with all the particles. Like it's been made with um Movie Maker. Yeah, it's quite quite bad, quite um quite bad quality of um, animations. Crappy. Yeah, quite crappy. Well, um, very well said. <laughs> all right, so thank you for watching, guys, and um, I'm not off media. This is gullible on the ceiling. Yeah. April Fool. <laughs> hey, that was like seven hours ago. Ends at like Yeah, but I prank you. Doesn't matter. Alright, so thank you for watching guys and um I will see you next week.